We are at the Christmas Gift and Hobby Show with Doug Davis, Lego fanatic. Can you, I guess you can, you must be a fanatic, yeah? I must be. Okay, and this is, the, we, you and I have done this for many years. Many years. We always have a contest. Absolutely. We're going to do it this morning, but just tell us about this first time display. Okay, so last year we had a little Christmas village on display. It was yeah. kind of a Norman Rockwell style. They said, Doug, I want you to go bigger. Most people don't make that mistake to tell me to go bigger. <laughs> so we okay, went three enough. times yeah. bigger yeah. and we went four times taller. So I think we nailed it on the size of this. Well, that's a big draw. People love to see this. <laughs> now, we're, we have not given up on our contest. Oh, no. So walk this way and here's what we've done. Okay. Good morning, guys. Good morning. What's your name? J-Dub. Le Lego Fanatic, right? Yeah. And your name is? Keith. Lego fanatic. Yes. Uh, I, forgive me for making this assumption, but you're a little older than him. Yes. Have you always loved Legos? Yes. Okay, so here's the deal. Doug has agreed to give you guys one of these larger sets, but we're going to have a contest now to see who can, what's this, what is this one, Doug, real quick? Is this one is the new Frozen 2 Olaf set. Okay. Are you ready, guys ready? Yes. I'm going to give you about 45 seconds on your mark. Can we go by the instructions? Get set, go, you don't have to. And, and Doug, while they're doing this, let's talk a little bit more. Legos has never lost its popularity. Yeah. No, absolutely not. Yeah. And Lego from day one still works with today, 55 years later. So I have Lego sets that were my brothers when I was a kid, and I still use them in builds today. Okay. It now all fits. It, now, uh, Keith asked me an interesting question. He said, uh, do we have to look at the instructions? Do m most people do look at the instructions. Well, it, yeah, most times on a smaller set, sometimes when you've done this for a while, you look at it and you go, oh yeah, I know exactly how they did that. Okay. You know what I think we're gonna do? John is shooting this now. We're going to take sort of a time-lapse break. Okay. And come back here in about three minutes <laughs> and see who's done a better job, okay? So you guys keep working okay. and through the magic of television, we'll be back in a couple of minutes. We've come back for just a moment here with Doug, but tell us about this real quick. So this is based off the Stranger Things television show mm -hmm. and it builds it in the real world and in the upside down world. And if you're a fan of the show, you're cracking up right now. Let's show everybody what's been happening in the last few minutes as Keith, and uh, Jacob. Jacob have been um, competing to see who can put this together first. What are they putting together? They are building the Frozen Olaf from uh, Disney's Frozen 2. All right, let's take a look at where they are. You know, I am no expert, but it looks to me like it's pretty close. It is very, very close. Very close. I think I'm gonna call this a tie, okay guys? Present them with their gifts. All right the guys. Contest. You guys get to pick, I got two prizes here. You pick something else over there, up to the, the prize amount on this thing here, well, whichever you like. Well, just pick one up, Jacob. It makes good television. <laughs> show it to the camera. Keith, show it to the camera. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Indianapolis Indi Gift and Hobby Show will be back. That's fantastic. That is cool. I don't know how they're making sense of all those pieces. Even at the beginning, they're shaking them all out. It's and been a while. The little boy was already like, okay, that one over here, and this one's going to need to be on this category. Right. How do you, how do you, you know you start. It's been a while since I've messed around with Legos. Uh -huh. My kids are now getting to that age, though, that they're oh boy. interested with it. Everybody so. got to wear shoes in the house. Oh, that's <laughs> that's the phase you got to oh. be. In. You've seen Home Alone too many yeah, times. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> no, that's true. Fantastic. So, very cool though, and it's it is fascinating how they just kind of keep up with the times, and Legos continues to be popular. Yeah. Right?